Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies. And we're getting pretty close to the end of the harder version of the adventure mode. So let's see if we can get to the end of that now. Oop, there we go. <laughs> Took a bit, it's fine. Uh, so let's see if we can get to the end of this now. So let's grab all the things that we might need. I didn't want that, I wanted the umbrella leaf. Uh, let's grab a potato mine because that's always good to have. It's also possibly a good idea to have a second one. Uh, do I want anything more than this? I can't change the catapult out because that's picked automatically. Uh, that might be actually really good to have, just in general. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with this, but I can probably grab another thing, which I should probably grab another potato mine. Now let's rock and see how this goes. We definitely want to have the umbrella leaf this time, so I can't misplace the sunflower, so let's do that. I don't have a rake, unfortunately, but that's fine. Since when have they ever helped me? I've, I've, I'm so good at this. I've never need, I did, never, never gone to the shop, bought, bought the max because I keep forgetting it's fine. I have used the rakes, but not as often as I probably should. It's fine. Anyway, scared of that zombie there. It's very nice that the, like the, the design of Plants vs Zombies is so nice. Like the way that they have the line, the columns, and all that, so you can actually see where stuff is going to be when they get to that point. It's, it's so, it's so good. <laughs> I, I really like Plants vs Zombies. I could, I could, I, 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 one of my fondest memories of Plants vs Zombies is playing the endless modes because you can just keep playing them for a while and just keep getting things. But just trying to last as long as possible is always so good. And I'm, I'm going to probably try and do that if I can. Now-ish. <laughs> In this playthrough, maybe. Ah, uh, but we have to do a few more things before we get to that point. Because I want to also unlock all of the achievements. Which will take me a little bit to get because we have to do... A lot of Endless, basically. From what I can tell. I need a little bit more sun right now, that'd be nice. Because the Endless works a little bit differently to just... A normal mode. Because you actually have... Like rounds, basically, of things, and each round you get to repick your plants or whatever, depending on the mode. But I, I, I'm looking forward to doing more of that because it's been a long time since I last played an endless mode. In this, I'm just gonna do that for the moment. Keep storing up some more sun. I want these as well, just to make sure that we got all good. Having the twin sunflowers is so useful for just more sun. And the music in this game is so good. I just wish there was more, I think. Like, more alternating music, I guess. Or like a music player or something, that you could just play whatever music you wanted to. But, anyway. Th things that I, I wish were in this game. This is just a game with the year edition. I don't think there's any of these features in a different version, but it'd be cool. I'm just going to type in a special code to unlock all of these features. <laughs> okay, I really need to do something about that cone zombie if I can, please. I would really appreciate something right now. I... Something that I can... Reasonably afford and be happy with. That's probably good enough, I hope. Please, 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 please. That's not going to be good enough. Oh, please. I was really hoping I'd get enough sun for... Oh, nope. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not happy with this. I'm not happy with this at all. This is a sad, sad, unfortunate end. It's fine. I'll just plant some other things in the meantime. While I try and figure out what I've... I'm just gonna contemplate my mistakes for a second. Okay, that was good enough thinking. <sighs> Goodbye. Just gonna accept this loss and rethink my strategy for a little bit. Need more sun. the real problem with this at the moment is I just don't have enough sun. Well, there's a bunch of sun, but it's not quite enough. 
Still not quite enough. There we go. Now we can do that. And that should be able to deal with a few, with a few things. Oh, there's a thing there, isn't there? I need more sun, please. Just gonna click all over here. Just gonna do that for the moment. Hopefully that's gonna be enough. If it slows it down, it will be enough. I hope. But let's find out. Because I can also afford a melon pot now, so let's do that. And I'll take it out for sure. Okay, so we brought it back. <laughs> there's still a missing spot and there's some empty- there's some holes in my defense, but it's fine. I just need more sun. <laughs> there we go. Just gonna work out a pretty basic setup that like I usually do. Um, oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. What I have done here. Oh, hello. I'm tempted to just save up for a little bit. To hopefully stop everything. This is not going to be enough to stop everything, but it's fine. Please. Take that. There we go. That's going to deal with that for a little bit, but it's not going to be enough. I need to actually solve this problem <laughs> that I've caused myself. I was doing so well last time. I don't know why I'm struggling now. It's because I didn't have a rake. Obviously. <laughs> That's the problem. Nothing else could have caused any problems for me. I just needed a rake. I should have realized. <clears throat> Well, I think I'm probably going to want another row of melon pulps. So I'll start working on that and let's get the rest of these winter melons done. I'm also going to need to defend these outer layers, I think, probably from these guys. Unless we can be just fast enough to take them out. Although I think they just aim further forward anyway. So they're not even a problem. Not as much as, as, as a, of a problem as I thought, at least. Uh, let me try and get another twin sunflower, please. Like that. And I think we're alright, probably. As long as we get more sun and take care of everything. Maybe set up some more potato mines out front and then get some more melon pulps. Yep, this is fine. Ah, uh, melon pole, let's put you there. Seems pretty good to me. Just have to wait for my seeds to recharge and my sun to regrow, I guess. Let me do that as well. We're up to the second wave. Just one more. My last one to go, more chocolate, good stuff. Get that for all the money that I need to get. Since I still need more. I've collected so much money. I have like 50 something hours in the game now. And that's like mo like 90% farming coins. In the Zen Garden. I don't even know if I'm exaggerating at this point because it's just been so much time grinding coins because each chocolate lasts for an hour. Okay, this is looking pretty good now. I think we're set for the rest of this level. I'm also particularly want to do anything else. I'm pretty satisfied with this. I could just stop right now and just let it be. But I have to keep collecting all the things. I don't know what it is, I just have to. I can drink some water in the meantime. Try and clear out my throat. I 
That's a lot better. I'm still a little bit sick. I can taste it in my phlegm. There is a lot of phlegm to taste, so. Just so much phlegm. Oh, hello. It's a good thing I had these potato mines in place to just absolutely stop everything that could possibly ever go wrong. My foolproof plan. Potato mines. My taters. Well, there we go. That is that. Let's keep going. Although I should probably buy a rake, because that will make everything go better, obviously. So, let me go buy a rake. Just like that. I'm tempted to buy some other stuff since we're so close to getting everything is 20,000. That's a very expensive. That's, that's expensive. Um. Oh, hold on. Did I buy the rake? I need to make sure I bought the rake. Yeah, I bought the rake. Cool. That's all that matters to me is buying the rake because the rake is the most powerful thing ever. Okay. Uh, <laughs> this is a weird set of items to have, but it's okay. I can work with this. Probably. Hopefully. I'm not entirely sure, but it's fine. Uh, maybe I want chompers. Do I? No. I want- I want- want- I want- I want- I want- winter melons. I want winter melons. I think this is good. Probably. Let's find out. Let's do the semi-sunflowers again. Since I'm pretty sure there were bungee zombies. That we have to worry about. I feel like there's different stats for each space of the board for some reason, because like sometimes I feel like I get more sun than I get from other spaces. And it's weird, and I don't know what it is. But I feel like there's just something about the... the tick speed or something. <laughs> just where you put something will do different things, and it's weird. I think it's just on my mind, but I... I feel like there's something here. It's a good thing there's a rake there, I was almost about to spend some more sun that I didn't need to spend. Get rid of that. Gonna run into some problems pretty fast though, because we don't have a, a second potato mine to put down. So we are gonna have to get some sun reasonably quickly. Okay. It's all good. Everything's good. Don't panic. Everything's fine. We have all the sunflowers we need out now. We just need... A few other things in place, and we'll be good. Mainly, we just need watermelons, and hopefully... ...not have zombies in places that we can't defend. Might even be a good idea to just wait... ...to see where the next zombie's gonna be. And then, stop that. You know, playing it smart is just the way to go. Rather than just rushing everything and being wrong. I'm also going to hold off on uh, winter melons for a little bit. Because I'm pretty sure I should be spending sun in other places first. Okay. Oh, hello. I'm going to blow you up. Because I can't think of anything else I can currently do at this point in time to stop you. I could have waited a little bit longer and I've had an I would have had enough sun, but it's fine. Wait for the next zombie to spawn in. Need to take advantage of all these potato mines that I have. The opportunity to use. Hopefully the next zombie isn't going to be behind this one, because that's going to make things very annoying. Nope, it's in multiple places. Okay, well let's take care of that one, because that one's going to be more annoying, probably. Except that probably, probably doesn't matter which one I did, as long as I put the one on one of them. Uh, we also have an extra, so I'm going to hold on to that for a second. Upgrade that. Okay, that's protected, pretty good. Uh, but not there, so let's grab- get rid of there. I'm actually playing well, what is this? This can't be right. Also, there are four waves of zombies in this. That's a lot of zombies. Uh, also I'm gonna need something for the top row in a second here, but we just about have enough sun for that, so let's do that. It's all coming together. It's all working. I just need a little bit more sun for this last row. As long as nothing- ah, uh, of course, of course, of course, of course. I'll take care of you. And then put in a melon pulp in a second. Right. 
And I don't know when I want to put in the umbrellas. The umbrella leaf. Probably soon. So let me start working on that since we have extra sun. Let's draw out this time that we have now. Put in some extra things. I almost messed up, but it's fine. This is what twin, twin sunflowers are for, is making more twin sunflowers. Okay, there we go. Basic defense set up, and let's put that in there. Good. Now we just need to upgrade. And then we can manage what else we're going to do. This should be a fairly long round, so let's see how we go. Slow you down. The winter melon takes a while to recharge, so we're going to be... Most are right on that. We could probably expand out in the meantime. As long as we keep keep getting enough sun for it. I don't want to expand all my sun at once though. Okay, that's fine. Just need to keep that in mind that those are those gonna keep dropping in. Um chocolate. Very nice. Let's do another twin sunflower. Keep collecting sun, please. Uh, I really want to do the next winter melon over here, but I can't do that yet. So let's just hold on a minute. Because we have a lot of sun, but we could we can use this wisely. Like that. And now we're pretty set. Okay. Next move is going to be another thing. But we're also going to need to defend those because those could get taken at any time. Okay, interesting, interesting, interesting. Just gonna hold on. Keep just keep keep going slow. Slow slow and steady wins the race. Don't don't overthink it. Don't go crazy with sun spending. And everything will be fine. We're almost up to the second wave. That was probably a mistake, but it's fine. I'm gonna go with it. Okay, let's do that. Please, thank you. We need a bit more sun so we can start putting in some more winter melons as well. But in the meantime, let's put this in here for some extra protection for the from the next wave. Because things are about to get harder. There we go. Third wave. There's only two more sunflowers left to upgrade, so we can probably get to those this round. Okay, that's fine. Just need to manage the crowd now, mainly. Because the, the zombies are mostly freezing up from the winter melons. We have to wait for that to recharge anyway. So let's go ahead and put that there. Okay. We can do the same at the top. Except that the winter melon is almost recharged, so we're going to wait for that. And then if we get enough sun, we can also put in the last melon in that column. Uh, let's put that down there for the moment. The middle should be fine. But I'm more, more worried about the outside than anything else. There we go. Nope, not that one. Ah, it's fine. I had to make a mistake at some point. And we're going to have plenty of extra sun as well, so... But now we're pretty, pretty good. Just need to make sure that nothing else can get through. want to have enough power going through to make sure that nothing fast can get past, because I think fast zombies are going to be showing up in a minute. So we just want to increase power, probably, and make sure we have all the win 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 winter melons in one column. There are going to be a few weak points because of the umbrella leaves, but it should be fine. For the most part, slow, slow them down, please. Thank you. The fastest zombies are starting to drop in. Let's do that. Last winter melon is in place. And we're over halfway. Getting close to the end, actually, pretty much. And then once we have some more power going through, it'll go by even faster. Okay. That's a goal. That's all those taken care of. Boing. that melon pot in there. And let's see if we can get one more column of melon pots just for some extra damage output. Off 
that. Probably should have put it in the one of the adjacent lanes to it, but that's fine. We have plenty of time and sun at our disposal over time. <laughs> so basically just time. Nope, that's not where I want to put that, but that's fine. It'll balance things out, possibly, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just making excuses for my mistake, but it's fine. That's pretty normal, though, as a human thing. Okay, our damage output is really good. It's, pr it's particularly good to see that our weakened rows are doing really well. The outer columns could use some help, though. Outer rows. It's fine. Very nice. Just want to put in one more melon pult, and then we should be really, 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 really good. Just like that. There we go. I'm satisfied with this setup. And we're up to the final wave, so that's pretty good. Just take everything out. Stop this zombie. Repair anything else that needs to be repaired. Probably needs to repair something. Nope, we're good. And we're done. So there we go. It's because I had a rake that it went so well. Oh boy, here we go.